Hi guys, uh, this is uh, a new amp I got today and I'm really happy with it. So I said uh, to myself I share like a video with you to show you that you can really buy good stuff in the music world for uh, little money, you know, uh, when they're second hand or like I went on KGG which is like a Craigslist uh, here in Canada and uh, I was searching for an acoustic amp so I can use it with my new uh, Seagull Momentum uh, acoustic guitar of which I did a review a few days ago so uh, I was searching online and I found a bunch of good amps I found a PV uh, acoustic uh, E20 which usually sells for 170 Canadian dollars or let's say 140 US dollars plus taxes and uh, shipping if ever you're buying it online and the guy uh, accepted to let it go for 50 Canadian dollars and he said it was like brand new condition then uh, I found another amp which really interested me a little more which is this amp over here it's the Crate CA30DG Taos acoustic amp and uh, I read the reviews about this amp and they were really incredible you know people were really happy with these amps and uh, it looks like uh, there was an uh, earlier version of this amp which was the CA30D and uh, after Crate uh, just made uh, this uh, updated version was, uh, because the old one had the controls in the front over here and this one has the controls on the top and uh, better handle, uh, better aesthetics, you know. So uh, it's a 30 watt amplifier, and uh, she was asking for a hundred dollars for it, uh, hundred Canadian dollars. So I paid it like around, uh, let's say, uh, 75 uh, US dollars. Okay, and uh, I got it for this price. And when I plugged it in today, I was really surprised, you know, this amp has an amazing sound, okay, it's so clear, so crisp, uh, it's like the natural sound of your acoustic guitar, but amplified, you know, plus it has many effects, built-in effects, I tried everything, everything's working fine, which is, I'm happy with it, you know, uh, it has a line out over here, I tried to zoom a little bit my cameras, You have the power button over here, okay? You have a line out so you can connect it to another amp or speakers or whatever, you know. Uh, you have an insert uh, socket over here, okay? This one, uh, I guess, it's uh, if you want to use pedals or uh, you know, foot switches, whatever. And you have the effects uh, over here, you have the level, which is the overall volume of the amp, okay? You have the effects over here, the effect switch. Uh, you have many effects, uh, slap, you have uh, bypass, which means you no effect at all. You have the slap, delay, echo, chorus, rotary, uh, a combination of uh, chorus and hall, room and hall, okay? So you have uh, like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight effects, and I tried them all, and you know, effects are not really—they don't modify the sound drastically, but they are here, you know. Okay, so uh, these are the effects. Uh, you have the like an equalizer with high, contour, mid, and low. Okay, and over here you have uh, the two inputs. Okay, so you have one input inputs that you can use one for let's say for your acoustic guitar another one for a mic for a microphone and uh, each input has its separate gain you have this gain for this input and another gain for you know, the other input over here okay and uh, another thing that I liked about this amp you have the kickstand in the bottom let me show you this you have a kickstand over here that you can open it's really sturdy you know you feel that it can take the weight easily it's a metal it's also made of metal and you can put the amp at a certain level and this way you can project the sound in a different way okay this is the 
kickstand and this amp is really really built like like a rock this way I can say about it it's really like a rock you know and uh, the thing over here the, the coating is really tough one I got is like uh, this is dark green I really like the color it's not uh, you know this disgusting green it's really uh, dark green which is good Okay, and there's another color that I see that it's gray or something. The main features of this amp, uh, this is a 30 watt amp, okay. It has an 8 inch high fidelity speaker inside, uh, a special design tweeter too. Uh, it has an uh, award winning uh, onboard digital signal processing with all DSP which uh, can be resumed in the effects over here uh, including a variety of reverbs, delays, chorus and multiple effect settings it has two channels as I mentioned before the three band equalizer okay uh, a quarter inch line out and the uh, slant front cabinet okay and the spring reverb the handle is really tough it can it's really very very well built and it's uh, in, you know like the grill is a metal it looks like metal over here and uh, I'm really happy with this amp I tried it with my acoustic guitar today it sounded amazing now I cannot try it because it's 3 a.m. and I live in a building so I have neighbors over here I can promise you this amp is worth it if ever you can get your hands on one for, for a good price let's say go for it you will like it, I'm sure of it. One thing I didn't like about this amp is that you cannot split the channels. So let's say if you want to use effects, you have to use the effects on both channels at the same time. Uh, I would have preferred that you know you can use the effects on one channel and let's say use the other channel without effects or you know with a different effect. But over here the effects are for both channels. You cannot split them. Okay. This is one thing I didn't like, otherwise uh, everything about this amp is perfect and for the price I got it, it's really a steal. I'm very happy with it, okay? Uh, in my future videos you will hear uh, how it sounds for sure. And uh, thanks for now, I just wanted to show you this jewel that I got today. So uh, thank you very much and uh, don't forget to hit the like button or subscribe if you like my videos and thanks bye